Hello YouTube, the Bearded King here, and this is going to be my attempt at a 1 to 99 thieving guide. As you can see at the top here of the screen, there's going to be is, uh, one, thieving 1 to 5 uh, men in this house, and that's this house right here at Long Bridge, Northeast. And you just want to pickpocket the men and women until level 5. And once you get to level 5, this is going to take you a while because you don't get much experience per pickpocket. But you will make a little bit of gold, so it's not too bad you get three gold per pickpocket. And uh, so yeah, one to five you want to do here. Yeah, okay. Now from five to ten, what you're going to do is you want to pickpocket, not pickpocket, but uh, steal tea from this tea store right here. Uh, this is the East Bank in Bar Rock. You just run over, it's right here. You want to stand right here. This is the perfect spot to stand, or you can stand um, over here. But I just like to stand on the edges of the table. We could also do is, um, you could steal cakes from our Ar drug, but I wouldn't recommend that because where you have to go for your levels is just way too much back and forth running. Unless you want to like power through levels, you can do five up to sixty-three if you want um, at cakes. I mean, you can really do anything you want. You can steal silk for money, but uh, I'm not gonna get into that. I'm just gonna go into it quick. Now, what you want to do with the teas is just drop them because I mean they're not really worth anything. If you want to save all your teas, then that's that's fine, but um, yeah, so uh, on to the next part. From 10 to 15, you're going to pickpocket farmers, and the best spot I found is right here at this crossroad coming up from Lumbridge going to Varrock. I don't know why he's on this side of the fence, but there's a lowly farmer right here, you can just pickpocket him. Then if there is a combat option, you can just spam click him, which is nice get some of that loot. I wonder how much how much do you get for pickpocket? It's five nine. Huh. It's cool. I guess you get nine gold per pickpocket. That's pretty cool. Ten pickpockets right there. Ninety ninety gold. So you'll make some more money doing that. You want to do this from ten to fifteen. Just power through it. And uh yeah, thank you. So from once you get 15 from pickpocketing the farmer, what you're going to want to pickpocket, as you can see up here, is 15 to 20 female hand members, and then 20 to 25 the male hand members. And the way you get it is when you're at this crossroad, you just finish pickpocketing your farmer, hit home. Hit home. I have 8 minutes. This is a technical fail. I'm just going to go grab my Lumbridge teleport just to speed this up. But yeah, make sure you, when you're done pickpocketing farmers, you don't have an 8 minute timer because that causes pickups and makes your video stupid. Bloop, 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 bloop. Okay, so this is going to take you to the same place. Just, uh, Quickest way to get around the castle is put your runnel, click over there because in Ultra Rune Screen, this area is not open like it is in RS3. I don't even know why they opened it up, it just makes it stupid. Takes away this easy run. And then once you get about to the corner, click here. And so if you do it right, unlike I did, it'll almost. So you come up here, sorry that's Jamie, he's uh, streaming Twitch, he's uh, basically photobombing my 99 Thieving Guide, like a douche. Okay, I'll pick up, I'll come down here, it's going to take you a while, a level of 15 Thieving, and this part's going to be hard. But, you want to open the door, come in here, and see the female ones look completely different, like this. they look like women. You want to pickpocket them. Do 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 pickpocket pickpocket pickpocket, and then eventually you'll hit 20 after like maybe a half hour. Pound like you get bring food when you do these guys definitely bring food. And you want to go over to the males pickpocket 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 pickpocket, and then about after an hour or so you'll hit 25, and then from 25. 25 to 38, you want to come into Varrock Castle here, go to the first floor back corner where all these uh, warrior women are, this is at 25 pickpocketing, you want to uh, pickpocket them until about, what you got, okay, until about 38, 
And the reason why you want to do this for so long is because the ones in between are, uh, I think, rogues and goblins, and you could do them if you want to, but this just keeps all your skill basically from 1 to about 55 all in Varrock, er, the Varrock area, okay? So you want to do this, and they give about 18... I'd say, yeah, about 18 gold per pickpocket. A decent amount of experience. You can look up the EXP uh, from each, but this isn't going to take you long. Probably about, maybe, if you do it, so about maybe an hour, hour and a half. So, ballpark estimate. So, you want to pickpocket these ladies until you hit 38. And then, from 38 to 50, from 38 to 55, you're going to do Master Farmers. Everyone loves Master Farmers. Because you can get Renard seeds, and they're like 35k a piece right now. So when you're done pickpocketing your warriors, what you want to do, you want to hit home, and yes, this time it works. <laughs> I'm sorry for scratching my face like that on front of you. But, uh, my manly beard here is just uh, kind of itchy. I should shave today. Like I showed you before, click over here, and your character will auto run. I'm thieving in the beginning for the first 63 levels. Tiringly boring, so uh, a tiringly boring skill. The worst thing you can do though is just rage quit and be like, "Uh, I got 53." And this this is all also if you're looking for desert treasure, this guy will help you getting 53 really quick. And believe it or not, uh. Until 63, this method is, in my opinion, a bit faster than Pyramid Plunder because Pyramid Plunder takes a lot of inventory setup. Uh, you have to have this, you have to have inventory to do it. Um, there's a lot of teleporting, running back and forth. So this way, it's just more straightforward if you power through it. You could probably have one to 63 doing this, maybe a day if you spend a whole day on it, maybe faster. I don't know. I never know life skills, but this this way really helps me do it. What I want to do is come over here and pick pockets. Sometimes you'll get lucky, and uh, Martin, the master farmer, will be locked in the pig pen. But basically, you just want to stand here. And the reason why this is the best area, and not the one by our drum, because that's your next stop, is because the bank's right here. So you can just, if you run out of food, you can run get food. If you want to uh, bank your seeds, you can bank seeds. See, you got a, I got a gum seed. And just keep pickpocketing. And, uh, yeah. Or, since, I mean, most people don't do him, because you have to, like, double click, but on, uh, this Master Farmer, you can just, uh, huh. That's cool. But, yeah, from 38 to 55, you do this. Um, it's tiring, it's gonna take a while, it's re it really is. I'm not gonna lie to you, it's not, it's not a quick part of the skill, it's one of those boring ones. If you're like me and uh, don't like having all these seeds and have to bank and drop once your inventory fills up, you could do this till 40 and then 40 to 55, you can just do guards at Barak or any really city and get out of the 40 gold each. Either or, it's about the same experience rate. I mean, obviously, guards are a little bit better. But it's about the same speed, you get caught the same amount of time, I mean, it's all really what you want. You want to try to make bank, I mean, or if you want speed, it's all up to you. But yeah, so 55, 53, you're gonna want to pickpocket knight. And the best way from our drug to here is just take a cannon, teleport. And you can't um, you can't teleport to our drug if I'm correct at level three because you haven't done the quest. And see in this guy that made 351 coins. It's making a guide for you guys. Um, I love thieving. I think it's, a, it's super relaxing. 63 to 99. 1 to 63 is probably the worst part. Like, every skill has their worst part. You know, where it's really slow and really boring. And, uh, yeah, for thieving, it's 1 to 63. Most people stop at 53 for desert treasure. But I really suggest once you start, just keep going. And, uh, 
for nights you want to do it like I said 55 to 63 or or really 63 61 63 I like 63 just because it's a good number good solid number um or you can do them 55 to 99 and they between I think it's I think 55 to 99 the evenings of nights it's good it's good exp an hour once you start gaining levels it becomes like a uh, Hundred and like it sounds like 88 uh, 88k an hour, 88k XP an hour. Not too sure about that. Don't don't take my word for it. Um, and you'll make around like I think like 10, 12 mil. Just because each each pickpocket is uh, 50, and it's like 100,000 pickpockets before uh, 99. So what I want to do? I'm basically, come from Camo, just walk all the way down. Into our drug. Sorry for this part of it taking so long. I'm not going to do one of those guides where you like, okay, how do I get here? I just want you to see every part of it. And also, this chat right here is the skillers. It's a, it's a really cool chat. It's really sweet. So you can pick, I can pick pocket powders, but we won't, what you won't look for. You can come here and do guards, but when you're 55. Don't mess with those small chumps. You want to come over here. And you want to pickpocket the big boys. And look at that. 450 gold for each pickpocket. You can lock them in a. You can trap them in a house. Have them all to yourself. Just sit here and pickpocket all day long. I mean, you want to have one on, obviously, just to keep up with them. I think you're supposed to sit here, sit here, spam it, spam, 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 and that's decent EXP an hour too. So all you do is sit here and spam like this. Okay. So, from 63 to 99, do Pyramid Plunder. Now, the reason why I'm not going to go to Pyramid Plunder and show you how to do Pyramid Plunder is because I've already made a 63 to 99 Pyramid Plunder guide for level uh, 3 skillers. I'm going to link that in the description below. So, if you find that this guide was helpful for you, please like, comment, subscribe, let me know what else you want uh, me to make. Um, every time I do a 99, I'm going to make a guide, sort of like this. Um, I might get better. I might take away my voice just do music. I don't know. I just want to know what you guys like. I hope you guys enjoy this. Um, I worked really hard on it, and I love my theme and cape. I want you guys to have one too. So, like I said, this part of this video is a guide on one to 63 thieving, and then 63 to 99 with pyramid plunder will be in the description below. I hope you like. If you do, remember like, comment, subscribe, and uh, have a very good day. Bye.